hi guys good day and welcome back to our channel if you are new here you're welcome and then to all our returning subscribers you're also welcome thank you guys for always coming back to watch our videos we greatly appreciate it and we don't take it for granted so guys today today is sunday the 5th of august 2023 and we are all going to church my nieces have been with me for today makes it a week they are here for the whole of this long break so um the oldest of them is 10 and then twins they are both they will be eight this august what i'm trying to say is they are old enough to go to children church all by themselves so today they will be going to children church and i want them to take ellison along i want to see his reaction like i want him to spend all the sunday service in children's church so i'll just take you guys along and we'll see how it goes this this is his first time going to this will be his first time going to church and he won't stay with his mom or his dad look at him look at him Look at him. Hi, baby. Say hi. The baby is ready for church. Say I hi. Listen, say hi. Ah, hello, everyone. Say hi now. Say hi. Okay, guys, I'll see you guys in church. Bye. Beautiful. I love your glasses. Thank you. Thank you. Hey. Okay, Jose, okay. I cry, cry to humanity here. What's happening? We found the children. Oh, 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 Good boy! Wow, you're looking so handsome. I love your jacket. We've got to put it together. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Where's my tag? Please don't just drop the tag. Make sure you sign up. Your no, dad is not running away. Thank you. Hi baby, how are you baby? How are you my baby? How are you? Thank you. Hi guys, so I'm here to give you guys the gist of how it went. Today is Monday already by the way. Today is Monday um 7th of um august 2023 yesterday was sunday the clips you guys have been watching was yesterday so guys when we got to the when we got to the church you know i mentioned that my nieces are with me i was thinking they would like be in the same room and no children's department now i didn't even know that in my church i didn't know that in my church there are still departments uh, there are still different departments on that children's department you know all these things you might not know them till you're a mom you get so i didn't know i thought all the children would just be inside one room singing dancing and all of that so when we got them they said section for toddlers are different sections for like grown-up children like my niece's age is different so and hey my heart began to beat fast like how will my baby do this so eventually <laughs> Hi, and his dad. We took him there, and God, he cried. You guys saw it. He cried. He cried. Those women were kept on saying, "I should go. That I should not worry. You will be fine. You will stop crying. I should go." So when we got back into the auditorium, that was into the church. My husband said, "We're going to check him in thirty minutes. Like every thirty minutes, we'll be going to check on him." I could no longer hold it. In fact, 10 minutes, I was already saying, I want to go and check my baby. I want to go and check on my baby. My husband was like, calm down, calm down. See somebody that he said he wants him to start school by September. We are ready to end this. 
So I was able to like hold myself for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, I went to check in, but I didn't want to just enter because the door was even shut. It was like closed. So I didn't want to enter. I was just peeping at the window. He was still crying. God, he was still crying with tears all over his face. The women were like making signs to me that I should go. I should go. I said, I want to see him. They said, I should not come in. That I shouldn't worry. I should go. You will be fine. You will be fine. So I went back into the church. My mind was there throughout, honestly. I didn't even concentrate on yesterday's sermon. So after like 15 minutes after I went, my husband too went to check on him. His dad went to check on him, check on him and he said he was already eating. Like he was no longer crying. But the woman was still holding him. Like the woman held him from the beginning of the service till the end of the service. That was so nice of her. So she, like he was on the woman's lap all through so um, he said the woman already that like they were already feeding him like giving, giving him food already so after service that we got there eventually he had already slept off on the woman's lap so he had already slept off like you guys saw now he had already slept off so that was how it went so my dear son Ellison, this video is about your first day in children's department in living faith church um in living faith church without your mom how do i have to say it like without your mom or dad's presence like this yesterday was the first time first time that my son will stay with a stranger as a complete stranger somebody he doesn't even know yesterday was the first time at all like he will stay there without the presence of a family member yesterday was his first time but guys that was how it went so if you've been with me from the beginning of this video till this point please don't forget and you've not subscribed please don't forget to do and don't just subscribe please like this video let me know your thoughts in the comment section guys as in more does if more does please when you watch this video share your experience with me in the comment section because i can't be the only one that that uh, that was like this the first time i, I can't be the only one that that went through this the first time um their, their babies or their baby went to church i can't be the only one so mothers please share your experience with me so i'll see you in our next video until then stay happy stay blessed we love you bye bye